Over the last couple of years in Australia, there has been a bit of a bread price war between the major supermarkets. In September 2014, Woolworths slashed the price of their home brand white bread to 85 cents. Coles and Aldi soon followed. This was met with some controversy as many independent bakers said they couldn't possibly make a loaf for that price. In the last few weeks, however, the price of white bread has gone back up to about $1. Fair enough, $1 is still very cheap. Throughout this price war, the price of wholemeal and multigrain bread has been fairly steady at around $1.50. As many of us would already know, white bread contains a lot less nutrients than wholemeal bread. The grain's bran and germ layers have been removed, taking away a lot of the mineral, fibre and vitamin content. I've always wondered why the healthier alternatives are usually more expensive. I guess it's to do with marketing. We always talk about the obesity epidemic and other health-related issues such as diabetes, but yet junk food is usually cheaper than healthy food. Due to the time involved in grinding the grain, for many centuries, leavened bread was a luxury reserved for the wealthy. White bread was even more of a luxury due to the extra time needed to sift out the bran and the germ. A family's social and economic status could be determined by the type of bread they ate. The poorest families ate the dark, whole grain bread. But not anymore. White bread is dirt cheap and is probably the most popular bread in Australia, maybe the world. Kids love it due to its softness, and parents love it because it's cheap. About two weeks ago, I saw that Aldi had reduced the price of its whole grain and multigrain bread to $1.35. So I decided that that's cheap enough to warrant switching our family to the healthier alternatives, and I bought a couple of loaves. Actually, my kids don't mind wholemeal bread, so I'm pretty sure I'll stick with it from now on. And then, just a couple of days ago, I saw that Aldi had reduced their prices again for wholemeal and multigrain bread to 99 cents, the same price as their white bread. I couldn't believe it. Finally, the price of the so-called healthy bread is the same as the white bread. It's about bloody time. Hopefully this is a sign of things to come. If Aldi keep the price of their wholemeal bread at 99 cents, then I assume the other major supermarkets will do the same. You never know, maybe fresh fruit and veg will become cheaper too. One can only hope. Bread is a big part of the Australian diet. If Aldi's decision to lower the price of their wholemeal bread encourages people to eat healthier, then surely this will be a good thing for Australia. I'd like to finish with a quote from American cook James Beard who once said, "...good bread is the most fundamentally satisfying of all foods, and good bread with fresh butter, the greatest of feasts." Cheers.